So you may have seen the previous video where I told you that a brand new, never seen before Duma OS interface was coming. In today's video, that's exactly what we're going to be talking about. Duma OS has always been on desktop, but we recognize that the modern world has changed. Wherever you are, if there's one thing that you always have on you, it's your mobile phone. So we are pleased to announce the release of Duma OS for mobile. For the first time ever, it runs as a browser on your phone giving you all the access of all the features that you know and love from Duma OS at your very fingertips. So one of the challenges was to simplify Duma OS for mobile, making it easier for the everyday person to set up and use without removing any of the technical aspects that make Duma OS so great. We think we've absolutely nailed it. And now I'm gonna give you a quick preview, a quick insight as to what you can expect. We will have more feature by feature, breakdown in depth videos coming on the channel very soon. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out, but let's take a look. Firstly, the initial setup. We've simplified it, it's much faster, and Duma OS will now do the hard work for you. Right off the bat, you'll have the option to select what you want to prioritize, whether that's gaming and or working from home. It asks for your home location, so your geo filter is set up around your home automatically, and you also have the option to run a speed test. We've also added a new feature called Ping Optimizer. This is designed to automatically find the best anti-congestion settings for your connection without the need for any user input. It's gonna run a ping test during the initial setup in order to do this. It's also something that you can come back to at a later date. Once set up, you'll see the new dashboard with a big, new, shiny red button. That's the new priority boost button. This lets you temporarily boost a specific type of traffic. Your gaming and working from home are already being taken care of depending on what you selected during the initial setup, but this allows you to give an additional temporary boost. So let's say you've got two hours to spare. You're gonna sit down and watch your favorite movie on Netflix. You can boost this traffic to make sure that your movie screening happens uninterrupted. You'll also recognize some of the existing features that you know and love. Fully functional geo filters right there at your fingertips. You've also got its trusty sidekick, Ping Heatmap. Select your game from the drop-down list and you'll see exactly where the servers are located so you know exactly where to put your filter. You'll then see network priority. This is pretty much QoS revamped and renamed so the average person can better understand it. It's here that you're gonna find congestion control and bandwidth allocation. Congestion control works very much in the same way as before. Bandwidth allocation has been adapted slightly for mobile with these easy to use intuitive sliders. You've then got some other old friends, network monitor showing you your upload and download usage. You've also got device manager which shows you all of the devices which are connected to your network. Then we've got connection benchmark, which is now split into separate parts. You're gonna find the option to run a speed test, a ping test, as well as taking advantage of our new feature, ping optimizer. And finally, for those units that are able to take advantage of it, we also have ad blocker, so you can keep all of your devices on your network free from ads and malware. So that's pretty much a summary of everything that Duma OS for mobile has to offer. At this point, you're probably thinking, when can I get my hands on it? Well, for R2 users, it's going to beta testing, so you guys will get it very, very soon. Our plan is to then work with Telstra and Netgear to get it on all other remaining units, as well as embedding it into their native apps for extra convenience, but it will also always be accessible on your browser. This is just one of the many things that are coming to you guys in 2022, off the back of two years of hard work, kind of stealth work behind the scenes from the team here. We can't wait to share it with you. We can't wait to hear your feedback and we look forward to sharing more with you guys very soon. See you next time.